Um, I'm really tired. The bin man has decided to turn up. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a first impressions video. This is something I'm actually really excited about. I'm testing out the new Maybelline Tattoo Brow. This is basically like a tint, like gel that you paint on your brows and you leave for like 20 minutes or something, I think I heard someone say. And then you like peel it off and like you've tinted your brows. It's basically to stop you from having to fill them in. This costed me £12.99. So I wouldn't say that this is like really cheap, but it's not like really expensive either. If it works, then I guess it's worth the money. I haven't read the steps or anything, but I'm guessing it's just going to be like you paint your eyebrows and you wait and you peel it off. <laughs> um, okay, so this is what it looks like. I got mine in the shade medium brown. So I've got a tiny little like angle brush because I'm pretty sure I saw a thumbnail. I'm gonna open it first time. Yeah. <laughs> the brush is like really thick. Like there is no way I can paint my eyebrows with that because it's so thick. It's like a lip gloss. So I've got you guys zoomed in because I don't see the point in me doing this without being zoomed in. So I have my, does it have instructions? Oh my God, it doesn't. So the box doesn't actually have anything in it. To be honest, I thought it would have like instructions. Okay, it says it at the side. There's like three little pictures. Apply a desired brow shape. Step two, let it dry for 20 minutes for up to, wait, what? Let dry for at least 20 minutes for up to three where let dry for two hours. Okay, I had no idea it took that long. I would have started this a lot earlier if I knew it had to be on for two hours for three days wear. And then step three, peel off inner to outer brow. Okay. <laughs> well then, I think I'm going to start and try this out. Where is my mirror? So I think I'm just going to like put this on the side and hope it doesn't fall over. And then I'm just gonna dip my brush in here. It's kind of hard actually. I don't really know where to start. I might start on the top and like do my arch. gonna dip it again and then I'm just filling in I don't really know how much I'm supposed to put down because I don't know what the put the puh I don't know what the colour payoff is like so I don't know if I really need to go heavy with this in order to actually get like a lot of a colour when I peel it off. I'm just gonna take it off the um, actual brush now because it's quite hard to get it from inside the tube. I'm kind of just like stroking upwards. I was literally so excited to see this in the shop. Like I was at the, oh fuck. <laughs> I should probably not talk whilst trying to do this. Um, but I was at I was at the um, Maybelline counter in Boots, and I was actually picking up um, a new mascara because I ran out of mine. And then I saw this in the new bit, and I literally got so excited because I've been waiting for this to come out like in stores because I haven't seen it anywhere. But I knew it was coming out. I prefer this eyebrow to this one. Damn it. I'm going to be so happy if I don't have to do my eyebrows tomorrow morning. Okay, so I think that looks okay. Um, that is usually how I would do my eyebrows and like the general shape of them. And I've put quite a lot on just to make sure that it's actually touching my skin. I might actually just use this. Just like put on top just to make sure there's enough product. 
So yeah, I think I'm going to leave it now. Um, I'm gonna have a look at what's the time. It's five past three. So I'm just gonna wait an hour, maybe a little bit longer, and then I'll be back and we can pull it off and see what has happened. Okay, so I am back. It has been about one hour since I started putting on this brow tint. It is pretty crispy. Um, it feels like, I don't know, it just feels like I've put loads of gel in my eyebrows, to be honest. I'm gonna have a look on the last step to see exactly what I have to do. It says peel off inner to outer brow. So I guess I'm going to do that. Um, I'm gonna start with the eyebrow that I started off with. Um, but I don't really know how to get this off. So I'm just gonna, ooh, I really hope, oh my God. It actually like has It has, it's actually dyed my skin. It definitely didn't come out all at once. I'm just trying to get it all off. It's like stuck to my eyebrows. So that's actually, oh, I pulled a few eyebrows out. That's literally my eyebrow with it all off. That's actually worked really well. I kind of wish I put a little bit more on the tails because that hasn't like really, it's not super intense, but I didn't actually want it to be intense. So that's good. Now I'm gonna try and get it off this. That's actually got nothing in it now. And it's not even rubbing away. Really impressed. Can you see how it's like actually dyed like my skin? Like this is how I would fill in my eyebrows and I would leave them like this. So if this stays, I will definitely be using this so I don't have to do my eyebrows in the mornings. So I'm going to zoom you guys out so like I can actually see what it looks like properly and not just up close. So I am actually really impressed with this. Um, the only thing that I would do different next time is add more product. Like I was scared to add the product but it doesn't look scary like I thought it would um, because obviously the product is so dark and it's like gel when you're putting it on your eyebrows it looks really scary so I kind of like held back a little bit but next time I definitely will be adding like more a little bit thicker to my tails because I feel like they will fade the most and a little bit like on the fronts a little bit more if you're interested in this product I do recommend that you try it um, watch a few reviews I guess and see if you like the look of it. So yeah I guess that's the end of this video. It was actually really fun to test out something really cool. This was actually quite different and fun to do so I hope more brands come out with things that are cool like this. Um, I feel like Maybelline has kind of like really done well and like made something different um, that I haven't really seen at any other drugstore brands do but yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you soon bye